In this video, I'm going to walk you through how to remove comments for your website. We're going to cover several different methods where we're going to remove comments, disable comments, not even allow comments to even get on your site. And then at the end, if you really kind of want comments, but you're tired of dealing with the spam, then I'll show you some spam protection techniques that will help with that. So if you're ready, let's get going. The first thing you want to do is head over to your WordPress dashboard because we'll make some setting changes. So the first one we want to do is let's go to our settings area discussion. And this is where we can change some of the discussion settings. So under discussion settings, under default article settings, we want to uncheck allow people to post comments on new articles. And that will help for any articles or any blog posts that are published on this site. The comment section will not be turned on. So once we're done with that, we can just scroll all the way down and then save changes. And so now comments will be closed on all of my posts. But when you turn this off for all future ones, it doesn't do anything to the comments that have already been created. So you have to go in and change that separately. So I'll show you how you can do that. Pages and posts both have this area that you can make changes. I'm going to show you how you do this under a page and go to all pages. And by default, pages comments are turned off for them. So if you do see comments on your pages, this is what you need to do. Go to all pages, select the page that you want to work on. And you should see this discussion tab here under document. Make sure that you're not under a block. Make sure you're under document and make sure you can see this. If you can't see this discussion tab, go up to the three dots here, go down to options, and want to make sure that the discussion panel is clicked. And so now once that's clicked, we should be able to see a discussions tab here that we can expand and will allow comments or disallow comments. So I'm going to turn comments off for this page. And that's an individual setting change. But what if you want to do multiples at a time? Well, you can go into all posts. And, and what you can do is highlight all of your posts. So click on the check mark next to title, and that will select all of the posts on your page. And we'll want to go to bulk actions. We'll click edit, click apply, and it'll bring up a screen where we can make changes to all of the posts that are selected. Under comments, we want to hit no, do not allow. And then let's update that by clicking the update button. And now all of the comments will be not allowed for future. Now you see over here, we still have a comment. So I'll show you how you can do that as well. So making comments not allowable means that nobody in the future will be able to make comments on these posts. Now, if you have comments already on your site, then you'll want to go to comments and you'll have to delete all of them. You can either select each one individually, or if you have several, several dozens or hundreds of them, simply do the same thing where you click on the check mark next to the author column, and that will select all of the comments on the page where you can go in and do bulk action of moving them to trash. And then click apply, and then they'll all be sent over to trash where you can then click on the trash button, select all again, and permanently delete if you want to. So that's a quick way to get rid of all comments that are already there. Now, a quick thing on this, if you have several dozen or several hundred, it can get a little tedious to keep having to go through each one, one by one. But what you can do is under screen options, under pagination, you can choose how many number of items are on the page. So you can, if you have hundreds and hundreds of them, go ahead and type in the number that you want and that will pull in that many on the page so you don't have to keep doing this next and next and next. So that will turn off all comments on previous posts that will remove all comments on previous posts and we've also disabled comments on future posts or pages. There are sometimes when comments are turned on media, the media page, if I view the attachment page, you see there's a way that people can leave a comment for the attachment of the media. And if you want to turn that off, then there's a little bit of code you're actually going to have to do. If you're nervous about adding code, don't worry. 
I'll show you a way that you can do it without code. It'll be using a plugin. If you wanted to do it without a plugin, then you'll want to be a little comfortable with adjusting your theme. So we'll want to go appearance, theme editor, and we'll have the code in our article and you'll see a link in the description below to the article where you can get this code. But basically you want to go into your theme area. Over on the right, you're looking for your functions.php page. So I'll click on that and I'll scroll all the way down. I'll start a new line. And I'm going to paste in this bit of code. And what this is, is to filter the comment status. And again, check in the description below so you can find this bit of code from our article on our website. So once you do that, we'll click update file. And then when you go to your library and you go to your attachment page, I scroll down, I don't have that comment area anymore. Now, if that made you a bit nervous and you don't want to do that, don't worry. I'll show you a different way that you can do that using a plugin. And the plugin is actually pretty good. It'll handle a few other things as well as the media. I'm going to go back into my appearance and remove that. All right, we'll go to plugins. We'll add new. And we're searching for a plugin called Disable Comments by Samir Shah. This is the one we want. So let's go ahead and install that. Once you install it, you also want to hang around to make sure that you activate it as well. And then you'll have an area, you can either click settings here, or if you ever have to come back to this, go to settings, disable comments to deal with the plugin. So from here, you can either choose to disable comments everywhere, and that'll remove it from everything. No worries. If you want comments on certain areas, then you can choose to simply disable the comments, say on your media here, and then that would remove that as well. And so those are several different techniques that you can use to disable, turn off, and remove comments from your website. What if you really like comments, but you're really tired of the spam commenting? This section is for you because there are certain ways that you can handle spam comments and you can battle them so that you can keep your comments on your website. One of the first things that I always do when I'm starting a new website is I'll keep or add a Kismet anti-spam. So you can install that. The other thing in tandem with the Akismet, it handles quite a bit of the spam, but some people have even started adding another plugin called the Anti-Spam B. So the Anti-Spam and the Anti-Spam B and the Akismet, they'll handle quite a bit of your robot spam stuff. But then one of the biggest ways that you can remove the possibility of having a lot of like humans coming out and spamming your site is simply by removing the link, the URL, the website link to the comments area. And to do that, you can add a plugin called comment link and other comments tool. Very long. This is the one we're talking about. Go ahead and install that and then activate it as well. And that will simply remove the URL from the comment. So people who are looking for a backlink and they're not looking to really interact with your site, They'll see that there's no way that they can add their website and so it won't be beneficial to them and it'll be an easy way for you to keep spam from happening while still allowing interaction with actual people who want to talk and interact on your site so those are several different techniques that you can use to disable comments on your site and thanks for watching